we use the present perfect continuous, remember, when we focus on an activity that is unfinished. So it started in the past and then it continues now and it's going to continue in the future. Here, I have another two uh, sentences. I've read that book you lent me. I have read that book you lent me. I finished it yesterday. I've read. ¿Por qué utilizo acá present perfect y acá simple past? I've read that book. So it means that I have the idea of the book. Also, I have all the story in my head. So I remember all the content of the book because this uh, it happened uh, recently. Here, I finished it yesterday. I'm using the simple past because I am telling you when did I finish it. Another, I've been, re I've been reading that book you lent me. I've got another 50 pages to read. It means that the action is unfinished. I started reading, but I haven't finished yet. So remember, the first perfect simple gives the idea of completion. While the present perfect continues, suggests that something is unfinished. Continue with the next slide. We have more examples here. She's been writing emails for three hours. Look at this. She's been writing emails for three hours. In this moment, this is happening. It started in the past, but it continues now. So she's been writing and she continues. Here, she's written 10 emails. Here we, we can count the emails. She's written 10 emails, so this is finished. The action is finished, but it finished recently. Cuando algo terminó recientemente, o podemos hacer un conteo de algo, we use the present perfect simple. Maybe the, the person is going to do this in the future. In the future, she can continue writing the emails. So for this reason, we use the present perfect simple, and we don't use the simple past. Let's see this. The present perfect continuous has been writing. This has been writing. Talks about how long something has been happening. The present perfect simple, this, has written. Talks about how much uh, or how many have been completed. Cuando hacemos un conteo de algo. How much, how many. 